Hey, what's up, everybody? It's Risky here. Welcome back to some more Call of the Wild. Today, we're doing something a little bit different. It's kind of a little idea that I thought of just like 10 minutes ago. And I was like, you know what? I'm going to hop on and we're going to we're gonna do that and see how it goes. So basically, it's called the three bow, three kill challenge. So I got all three bows in the game. Well, the three types of bows. I got the recurve, then we got the crossbow, then we got the compound bow. So basically, it's not really a hard challenge. I guess the hardest part about it is finding animals to kill, but basically what you gotta do is get three kills with all three bows. And it doesn't matter what animals they are, it's just, yeah, it, it, it's just a little fun challenge. I don't know, I think it's just something fun to do. It gives me something else to do, rather than just grab a gun and go out there and find something, it's just, it kinda gives me something to focus on and make it a little bit more fun while we're out here hunting today. So right now we're on Hirschfelden. Um, I just switched the time up from a good time and it was like pouring rain and now it's a little bit sunny out here so I'd rather be out here hunting in the beautiful sunny weather than the rain because I hate the rain in this game but uh yeah enough rambling on I'm gonna try and get out here and see if I can find three animals and I think I'm gonna try and get the recurve bow out the way first and then we're gonna move on to probably the crossbow and then the compound bow I don't know we'll see how it goes but uh yeah let's see if we can find anything god damn that is a huge level 7. Jesus Christ, that's probably the biggest level 7 I've ever seen. That must be the big rack that comes on those things. Because holy crap, I could have swore that thing was like a diamond. And then we got a little roadie right there. This is good, this is good. I think instead of uh, using the recurve, I'm just going to use whichever. I think I'm going to do the crossbow first. Just so I can try and get these guys. I don't know, I'll do whichever. I think I'm going to do the crossbow first. I kind of changed my mind here. Uh, but he's 80 meters. I got my red deer call on me, so I'm just going to try and call him in, and then we'll see if we can get that roe deer over there. All right, so the red deer is right there. I'm going to try and take a shot, and we hit him. Oh, that was probably a bad shot. I mean, he's going to go down. Yeah, that was a single lung, probably. I was trying to hit him in the heart. I probably rushed that a little bit too much, but he went down decently fast, so nothing to worry about. And I did call that red deer, or that roe deer, sorry. He's over there. We might be able to get him back. But we got one down with the crossbow. Let's take a quick look at this guy. That roe deer actually ran off that way. I didn't see him like on the other side of this hill and managed to spook him up. But there is some hogs that way that I'm going to go after. They're about 200 meters from here. I've seen him off in the distance. Pretty decent looking level 7 here. Not too shabby at all. Our Castex is already good, so that's really good. I'm actually going to taxidermize them because man that is a beautiful level 7 if I've ever seen one who knows I could be like over exaggerating but that's a beauty right there that is definitely a beauty not too shabby at all for our first kill of the video all right I'm gonna head this way like I said I seen some wild boar over there they're actually at a rest zone so they might be some easy targets I think I'm gonna go after them with the crossbow and just get the crossbow out of the way and then we'll decide which one we want to do next after all right, got some wild boar running up on me right now. They're getting real, real close. We're going to try and take this level three. I've been scanning the group here and just trying to find the best one, and this level three seems to be the best, so I should nail them. And the rest are probably going to take off. Actually, you know what? They might not. Let's see if we can nail this guy from way back here. Oh, god dang it. As soon as I go to shoot, of course he runs. Oh, god dang it. Okay, let's claim this level three. Come on, let me pick it up, please. Please, please, please. There we go. Oops. Yep, there we go. Where we hit him at? Double lung dumb. That was a beautiful shot. And we got a roe deer actually over here. So, I'm going to try and sneak over here to this tree line. And we'll try and get that one. And we will be done with the crossbow. Crossbow. <laughs> we'll move on probably to the recurve. I really want to do that. Because that would be fun and also challenging. But I don't know. We'll see. All right, got this uh, roe deer. He's running out right here. That actually looks like a piebald or something, doesn't it? I can't tell. I swear I've seen some kind of cool uh, color variety. Please be a piebald. That would be freaking awesome. Uh, is it? No, I don't think so. Dang it. I thought it was. Well, he's down. Please let me claim it. Yeah, I thought... I seen, like, the white there. I thought it was a piebald. Damn it. I wanted a rare, man. I don't have any cool, like, super, super cool rares in my lodge right now. All right, well, there is the crossbow down. Nothing special, just a level two roe deer. Um, now, 
let's do the good old challenging recurve bow. I really All right, so I got some wild boar in front of me. I think I'm going to try and get a shot on one of them, hopefully, if they don't run off on me, because I don't want them to do that. Try and take them with the recurve bow. I want them to get at least, like, 40 yards from me or something before I take a shot. Because I don't really trust myself anything, like, with my aim, anything past that. Alright, we got this one right here, actually. If it stops, I'm taking a shot. Oh, God. See? <laughs> this is what I said about the recurve bow. Oh, boy, oh, boy. This is going to be fun. Oh, man. Here come the uh, comments. Saying, oh, you suck. <laughs> oh, I know. Trust me, I know. Got this other pig right here in front of me. He's a level 2 male. So he's a boar. The other ones are just sows. I want to get a good range on him. So he's 30 right now. I'm going to let him get a little bit closer because he's still coming towards me. Come on, buddy. Get a little bit closer for me. Come on. Just stand out in the road. That'll be perfect. Oh, I hit him. Oh my gosh, it's a miracle. I don't think I hit him very good, but I hit him. And that's all that matters. He's gonna die. Some time or another. <laughs> oh boy, we're gonna be tracking this thing for years. No, not with the arrow, but... Jesus. Oh, there he goes. He's running this way. Super interested to see where I hit this guy. Got a little level 2 road here after that one. Or over there. We might try and go get him. But anyways, let's see where we hit him. Ah oh, man, that was almost a good shot. Almost. We're just a little bit too high and to the left. Well, not even too high, just to the left. Because that was almost a double lung or whatever. Probably a double lung. Damn. Okay. Well, at least he died. That's all that matters. So that's one down with the recurve bow. I'm just trying to get, get done with this recurve because the compound is going to be easy. I know how to use that thing no problem. We won't have any, any problems with that thing. But the recurve is definitely the most challenging one. Okay, got a roe deer literally right on top of me right now. I can't even see me. See myself. Oh, yeah, we dropped him. I don't know. I didn't mean to say see myself. I can't even see him. I can obviously see myself. I don't... Okay, anyways. <clears throat> Excuse my English. We got him down. We dropped this guy, too. I'm proud of myself on that one. Double lunged him. And integrity bonus is down. But it does not matter. This is not a challenge of uh, trying to kill the biggest animal. It's just trying to kill three deer... With three different bows. Or three animals with three different bows. And, uh, we got it. We did it. Alright, wait, actually, no, we need one more with the recurve. God damn it, I thought I was done. Got this little, uh, road deer right here. It's about 20 meters out. I'm gonna let him get a little bit closer. Come on, buddy, stop for me. Stop, 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 stop. Oh, that was lucky. I think I hit him in this. The, the left scapula or something like that. I guarantee it. That's what it sounded like. It sounded like I hit a bone. But, to say the least, or whatever the proper term is, he's going to die. And that's good. Oh, man, there's pigs over there. Okay, that's good to know. That's good to know. We can go after those. Oh, we, we got medium. So, it might be better than what I think. I don't know. We'll see. He shouldn't be too far up here. Uh Oh, what the hell? <laughs> Nowhere near where I thought I hit him. I hit him in the freaking neck, apparently. Not even the neck bone. The neck flesh. Alright, well he died pretty quick anyway, so not a big deal. And that is finally done with the gosh darn recurve bow. I can finally pull out this beauty. The Hawk Edge, I think this is what this one is called, or something like that. The compound bow with the beautiful 5-pin sight. I can finally aim and hit something properly. <laughs> Okay, so I'm going to put this tree stand up in this tree right here. There's a couple hogs over there. I don't know if you can see them. You probably can't because it's very hard for me to see them as well. I'm hoping they don't run off, but I think i just seen one run off while I'm doing this. I'm going to put this up here, and we're going to get up in it. Oh, this is freaking awesome, dude. This is, what I, this is what I love right here. Getting up in a tree on the edge of a field, just looking over the field like this. This is sick. Okay. Well, let's look at the pigs that we got. We got a level 3, level 2, and then eight, another level 3 right there. 
Okay, I'm gonna get the caller out. I'm gonna try and get these guys a little bit closer. I'm confident shooting about 50, 60 yards with the three pin sight or the the five pin sight on the compound bow. There's no problem there. Um, but I'm gonna try and get them a little bit closer because obviously they're about 100 yards or something like that from here. And I don't want to be shooting that with a bow. All right, so the kid, the the pig's really close right now. He's still getting closer. Let's get a range on him. He's 35 right now. Let's get our bow out. We'll just range her like 40. And that should drop him really, really quickly. Let's go for a long range shot on one of these guys. Oh, we just missed him. Let's try and get him. Oh, we dropped him, did we? Oh no, we hit him, I think. Alright, this wild boar is getting about 44 meters out right now. Let's pull out the bow. Go to about 40 meters and stay there, bud. And did we even hit him? I swear we hit him. We had to have hit him. There's no way we missed that. There's no way. I honestly don't know if I missed him or not. I heard the shot, like I heard the noise. Like the, the squeal or whatever, when you normally hit them. Kind of like the other one made. And, I don't know, we might have made a bad shot. But there is a road deer. That is the one that I heard earlier in this one I was talking about. So, just going to sit up here for a little bit longer. I like sitting up in this stand anyways. It's pretty fun and just relaxing. So I'm just going to try and call this dude in. And see if we can get us a road deer down. A road deer came out. I don't even know if this is the same one. I'm assuming it is. He just took a different route than I thought he was going to do. But we might as well just get the bow out now. And unfortunately, this tree's in the way. So hopefully he comes out a little bit more. The wind is actually blowing his direction, but we're up in a tree, so it shouldn't really affect it that much. Okay, here we go. And he is down, and that is all three animals. I'm actually going to go check that way, or check for blood and see if I did hit that other hog. I swear I did, because I heard the little squeal or whatever. Um, but I don't know if we did hit him or not. But at first, let's claim this road deer. We've killed nothing but level 2 road deers today. I never see anything better than those. And we broke his leg. Both of his legs. Went through. Just missed his heart. Oh my gosh, that was close. Single lunged him. That was honestly a super lucky shot there. I just missed his heart and clipped the, the lung there. But let's go check over here for some blood. Uh, I don't know if there's going to be any. That's for this pig right here. Okay, we did hit him. We did. Alright, so we got four animals with the compound bow, but we did that. We, we killed that roadie right there just to make sure we get, we got one, because I honestly was not even certain if I killed one, or if I hit that hog, I'm sorry. But let's claim this dude. Single lunged him. And we'll go track this dude real quick, and then we'll go get that last one over there, because I know where it is, but this one we might have to track a little bit. Alright, he ended up not running too far. Stan is just over there somewhere. And then claim. I'm interested to see. Oh, yeah, we hit him in the leg. Ooh, terrible shot. 44 meters away. I don't even. I don't recall aiming there at all. But, okay. Makes sense, I guess. Not really. But let's go claim. Let's go claim this other one. I'm honestly really interested to see how far we hit this one uh, from or whatever. What the distance was. Because I believe it was like either over 100 or close to 100 meters. All right, let's claim them. What's the distance? Uh, 87 meters. Okay, yeah, not not as far as I thought. What the hell? We hit him literally in the ass cheek. We cut his ass cheek right open. That's the way we killed him. Okay, well, that's it for that. Well, that was the three bow, three kill challenge. The three bows, three kills. That's probably what I'm going to title this video. If you liked it and you thought that was pretty cool, Go ahead and let me know in the comment section down below and also hit the like button. And uh, let me know if I should do any other challenges because personally I think that was pretty cool. It was different, unique, and honestly quite fun to do. And I think I might do some other challenges like that, like three pistols, three kills, three shotguns, three, three kills. We'll see how it goes. But uh, yeah, thanks for watching the video, guys. If you did enjoy it, hit the like button, subscribe if you haven't already. It helps me out so, so much. And I'll see you all in the next one. Later.